it's a red light and he stopped and from behind someone hit him and then he got 50% of the penalty. Really? Yes. People don't like to speak directly here. Um, so in America we would say it's impossible. It's impossible, it means we can't do it. But in Japan they say it's difficult means I can do it, but it's a big problem. Any kind of healthcare problem, it's so cheap and it's so easy to get taken care of. Like sometimes you may have to wait, like it takes time, but you will always get treatment and your life is not ruined by paying for healthcare. Mm. What's your name? Uh, Skip Taylor. Hi, nice to meet everybody. Uh, <laughs> thanks for watching. What's your name? I'm AJ. AJ. Okay, what's your name? Reese. Reese. Yeah. Where are you from? America. America. We're all from America. Yeah, we're all Americans. All Americans. America, yeah. Okay, so do you guys live in Japan? Yeah. Yes. yes. Nice, so how long have you been here? About 20 years. It's about 20 years. Yeah, we came here together basically. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. So how did you guys meet? Um, through our English language exchange program, where we were uh, JETS. Yeah. JETS. JETS. Yeah, J-E-T. It's the it's from the Ministry, you know, the Education Ministry of the Government, and we came here on that program from our country. Well, what do you do for your living? We're teachers, but for me, I'm also a writer. So sometimes I do like writing projects, and I'm a, a performer, entertainer. So I do live performance too. Teacher. Yeah. Teacher. Teacher and continuity consultant. I help people prepare for an emergency. Earthquake, tsunami, typhoon. I help make sure people are prepared for what's going to happen. My question is, what's it like living, living in Japan? It's nice, it's good. Yeah, I enjoy it. It's, yeah, it's mostly good, I'd say. It's mostly good. I think that, that everyone who comes here, if they stay here for one year, two year, three years, they have a time where everything is great because it's different, it's new. And then, but after a while, you know, like you start to see the, the kind of the bad points more. Mm -hmm. And so you have to have a balance, you know, like is it, if it's, everything's terrible, then you, sh you know, then you should probably go back home. But if it's like some, there's some things that are good and some things that maybe you don't like, then, you know, it's, it's life is like that everywhere. Mm -hmm. it, every place is going to be the same. There's some good stuff and there's some bad stuff. So. I think, you know, um, if you're here for a long time, then you have to think, okay, well, how much is good and how much is bad? You know, if it seems like there's so much bad, then uh, maybe it's the wrong place. But if mostly it's good, but there's some bad stuff too, then, you know, well, it's the same in your home country. It's the same every place. So I think, you know, uh, for all of us, uh, we're still here. We're still here. You know, maybe sometimes we want to get away, but, but uh, we're still here. So I think mostly it's good. But of course, nothing. There's no perfect place. If there's a perfect place, all the world goes there. <laughs> yeah, it's and, then true, it's so not, and then it's not perfect. Yeah. <laughs> so there you have it. <laughs> what kind of thing you don't like or you you hate about Japan? Some of the laws are kind of crazy, to be honest. I mean, um, that um, if you have a problem um, and you want to defend yourself, you're a foreigner and you get in trouble. Not the not yeah. the bad guy. The bad guy doesn't get in trouble. You get in trouble because you're a foreigner. The police oh. come and they say, "Well, the bad guy goes free, but you you get in trouble because you're a foreigner." Even if, even if the other person is really the bad guy. Yeah, my my friend, he was in a car accident, oh. and he was stopped. So there was a stoplight, and he stopped. It's a red light, and he stopped. And from behind, someone hit him, and then he got. 50% of the penalty. Really? Yes. And I think that if he was Japanese, maybe it's no penalty yeah, because he stopped. Yeah, yeah, yeah of, course, of course. Of course, of course. Yes. But they said, oh, you should have seen him and you should have pulled forward, even though it's a red light. What? So it's yeah. crazy. So yeah, yes, and I, I injured myself in 2014. I got an injury from broken glass in Shibuya. It was Christmas vacation, so I was going home, and I went to a hospital and got my leg, you know, um, it had a cut, a big cut on my leg. So I went to a hospital, I was sitting in the hospital, and no medicine. I was, like, they said, oh, there's somebody with a head injury, so you have to wait. No medicine, no bandage, 
no nothing. And I was going like, oh my God. So I'm in a hospital, my leg is cut open. What? And there's nothing. So I said, give me, give me my backpack. I have like some disinfectant. I was like, I'll, I'll take care of it. <laughs> <laughs> and, and then I went back home to New York. And when I came back here, there's a letter in my mailbox that said, you have to pay for the broken window. It was written in hand. So I think it was not real. So um, uh, I said, what? I'm not going to pay this. It was like, uh, like 180 ha yen for so the broken expensive. window. Really? Yeah, in, in Shibuya, yeah. So, so, but there was a restaurant, they have insurance. So um, I said, well, this is, this is great. I'm not going to pay this. So I brought it to my work and they said, well, let's call the number, call the phone number. And somebody said, um, kind of like, my, my Japanese teacher friend, she talked to them. He said, yeah, huh, 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 okay. And she put down the phone and said, don't pay anything. This is, this is not real. The worst experience I had was when I was teaching at a city in Chiba. I had to go to the police station to ask how to find my school. And the police officer asked for my alien registration card and they made a photocopy and when I said why did you make a photocopy they said it's in case there is a crime committed in the area we know who to come to oh. so they just assumed immediately I'm here I must be a criminal in the same time a few years later, in Ibaraki, the police were going through our apartment building and checking the residents. And when my wife said that I was living here and that I was a foreigner, they went, oh, okay. And that was it. No other questions, no, please let me see your ID card, nothing. They were very kind. They were very good. It's taking a little time, but I think the ideas are starting to change. If you have a group, you know, any, any community that has a large number of people, yes, some percent, some small percent are not nice people. You know, and that's anyone. It's the same in Japan, same in America. And I think that um, when you have a couple of bad stories, and people don't know the truth. They think, oh, well, everybody is like this. Everybody is bad because they don't have experience. You know, and I think that, you know, um, you can't talk to people and say, yeah, but that's not everybody. It's just what you see in the news. You know, they, they won't listen. They'll just go, la, 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 la. <laughs> I can't hear you. Sorry. You know, <laughs> so, so I think, you know, we have to be an example of like, look, we've been here, we've been here 20 years. You know, I've never been arrested. You guys ever been arrested? No. No, we've never been arrested. Okay, but but still, the news sell these. They can't wait to say, "Oh, here's the bad foreigner. Here's the bad foreigner." Okay, look, here we go. Here you go. We're gonna take him off to jail. And, and it's, you know, it sells news. It sells newspapers. It sells TV shows, but it's not the truth. It's just not the truth. So I mean, I think it's important for us to, you know, I mean, I don't, I don't think we. It should be like a like a, a big backpack on our backs. But but you know, we've been here a long time, and you know, basically, we just. We live our lives same every day, same as everybody else. Yeah.